Tony Pollard has agreed to terms to sign with the Tennessee Titans. Now what? Good people, it's your boy Mr. Rome, Cowboys Fan Talk, right back, like I never left. And just to let you know, this week, I'm going to be right back like I never left a lot, like a whole lot, like multiple videos a day, lives, etc., because it's going to get wild. And this is the first domino to fall this week. Um, Tony Pollard is signing with the Titans, I think on a two-year deal. Um, I haven't seen the numbers yet. If y'all see the numbers, y'all put them in the comments because I wanted to get this to y'all as soon as possible. Um, yeah. Now, either we're going to go sign, like everybody would love to say, let's do running back swaps. Let the Cowboys get Derrick Henry. Y'all get Tony Pollard. Still don't know if that's going to happen. I'm not here to hype that up. All I know is we got a running back opening. Now, don't get sad like we're the only team that's getting left out there looking stupid because the Eagles, DeAndre Swift, signed with the Chicago Bears for $24 million. So, you know what I'm saying? We ain't the only ones out here looking for a running back. <clears throat> but, you know, I will say this. The Eagles might be more likely to get a signing done before the Cowboys because High Roseman is the least aggressive. So they might end up with Saquon Barkley. They might, even though the Chargers are interested in him. So we'll see how this goes. But listen, this running back carousel, this running back merry-go-round, let's say, say, let's say running back musical chairs is going down. Um, Tony Pollard lands in Tennessee, right? Because Derrick Henry gone. DeAndre Swift lands in Chicago, right? Now we're going to see where these other people land. I'm just saying this. The Cowboys need to stop being, like, lazy and sitting around and just, they'll come to me. Tony Pollard will just be there waiting. No, i seen Swift get signed and Pollard get signed, and everybody thought that Saquon Barkley and Derrick Henry were going to be um, the first dominoes off the board. I think Swift and um, Pollard get signed first. Um, apparently, Josh Jacobs is signing back with the Raiders. So that's that, that's not happening. At least that's what I saw report-wise. Like, seriously, you play around, we're going to be sitting there having to draft the running back at 24. Now, I would take a certain running back at 24. We have to, but you don't want to be pigeonholed into that, and then you're waiting at 24, hoping to get a running back, and somebody jumps you and takes your running back. Now you ain't got a running back for next year, and we're running out there with, 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 with Zach Moss because we ain't got no other options. You know what I'm saying? I want the Cowboys to get assertive. This should be a sign. Hey, can't just wait around and just think people just can't wait to sign with the Cowboys. No. Tony said, listen, listen. Oh, the Titans want me? Sign the deal. Send the deal over. And he left. I wish Tony nothing but luck. <clears throat> I'm not even saying Tony's washed up or not going to have a good year. I just think his time in Dallas was going to be up. And it is. He's gone. He sees the writing on the wall. He doesn't want to be second fiddle. He don't want people to say, well, you're not a number one back. Tony Pollard got a chip on his shoulder. He want to prove himself. Good for him. The Cowboys front office should have a chip on their shoulder wanting to prove themselves. Because right now, we look stupid. You know, you can't roll no disrespect to Deuce. You can't roll Deuce Vaughn out there like that's the start running back. You know what I'm saying? Rico Dowdle's a free agent, too. He gone. We got Deuce Vaughn and, and Hunter Lipke. That's it. So the Braylon Allens, the Trey Bensons of the world, and um, Jalen Wrights of Tennessee, and Jonathan Brooks of Texas, yeah, one of them going to become a Cowboy. That's not a question. But I still want my veteran running back. Go get me one. I would love Derrick Henry. Before y'all say it again in the comments, I would love him. I just don't see the Jones family doing that. I pray they do. I would love for them to. But I ain't going to lie to y'all. Um, so we'll see where we land on. We'll get a running veteran running back, and then we're going to be praying we get a good running back in the draft, or we're going to be sitting here looking stupid. But look, at your boy, Mr. Rome. A little quick midday. We lost Tony Pollard video. And if something else happens... I might re I might re record in my car. I don't know what I'll be doing, but y'all gonna be getting content. Love y'all. I hope.